Hello and welcome back to part 5 of Let's Play Fable The Lost Chapters with your host as always, Madariah Bread. Between episodes, I did a lot, and I mean a lot, of trading produce between shops to get money, so I could buy myself the entire light, uh, light leather set, which is just brightly colored leather. It's the most basic armor, really. As well as a steel longsword, which is a little bit stronger than our iron cleaver. So, let's get on with the next uh, plot mission. I believe this one's at Orchard Farm. You get to pick between either attacking it, which will get you more money, or protecting it. I'm gonna protect it, because again, I'm doing choices that I would do put in this situation. And I get to show you guys the boasting system. So, we're taken outside where we can take on boasts, which will get us, uh, we wager a certain amount of gold, and if we complete it, we get more gold. Now... Where is it? No protection. Do the quest naked is a little bit misleading. It also means you can't use the physical shield spell, it just doesn't tell you that. Without a scratch is take no damage. That one is pretty easy if you've got a really powerful physical shield, so I think I'll take that one. Fist fighter, don't use any aggressive magic or weapons. No, that takes forever. Protect property, make sure no boxes or artifacts are stolen. Notice that they spelled artifacts wrong, yet they spell almost everything else right. I guess I can do that. And protect guards, ensure that no guards will die. I can do that. So let's take three boasts, this will be worth a lot of extra cash. So we go to Orchard Farm. You guys have already seen most of the way there, so I'll just skip ahead to it. So you're going to be doing some work down at Orchard Farm, are you? I knew that was your two calling. I saw Lady Grey set the opposite quest in the guild yesterday. Maybe I should pick it up. I hope you've been practicing. You'll need all the experience you can get to beat me. See you later, farm boy. She took the opposite quest. She's gonna try and raid the innocent farmers. What a wonderful lady. Looks like you guys get to see the Great Wood Lake now. This is where it is exactly, it's just in the uh, woods here. Just across the bridge. This is a pretty small area. It's a good place to easily get to merchants. And usually bandits spawn here. So sometimes they have good drops, you know, they'll usually drop uh, health potions, which is a nice money saver to get it just off bandits. Although it's very easy for the uh, merchants to die just because the bandits do hit hard. In fact, one hit me there. Usually you don't have this good of armor this early on. Oh, and uh, before we go, I believe there's a health potion back here. And is there anything on the other side? Nope. Anyone here sell anything? No? Okay. So we just crossed this bridge here, and this is the second entrance to Orchard Farm. The other one's blocked off right now until after the mission. Oh, thank Avo, you're here. I thought no one would answer our guild request. I've arranged some more security to back you up, but there are so many bandits that they'll tear my farm apart. I wish we'd never found those damn stones. They brought us nothing but trouble. My wife Jenna won't let them anywhere near the house, so we've left them in some crates in the barn. They must be worth a fortune. They say Lady Grey wants them. I've already lost three farmhands in these raids. That must be them now. i better go inside and look after my wife. She's terrified. Just nonchalantly walk over. Okay. Take no damage, yeah. Uh, renown. Okay. We'll get a lot if we can pull this off, so let's bring up the physical shield. We can't let any of the artifacts or boxes be stolen, and we can't let any of the guards backing us up to die. <laughs> uh, I like the one who yells at you shall not pass. Luckily, this mission is pretty easy. I think it's a little bit harder um, if you're attacking, I find. Also, the sound effect for physical shield is incredibly annoying. Bandit reinforcements are on the way. Uh, luckily, I believe this is the only direction they come from. 
Also, I'm trying to protect the guards. I don't want anyone to slip fast and attack the guards. The guards are stronger than the bandits. It's just, uh, I don't want to risk any of them dying before I have a group heal spell to uh, protect them. We're pretty much just going to camp this entranceway. On the attack mission, uh, guards will actually come in to stop you from stealing things, and they'll come in from both directions. I kind of don't want to fight so close to the entrance, I don't want to accidentally go through. Like, guards, can you back off the, en the entrance? I guess I'll back you up with an arrow. Unless I accidentally hit my own allies with it. I forgot there's friendly fire in this. Alright guys, get away from the entrance so I can do the fighting. I'm gonna drink one of my mana potions, I don't want to run out. Oh, that was it. You've learned some new moves, have you? Well, you're not the only one. I hope you've learned how to flourish, because that's the only way you're going to get close to me. Go Whisper, on. the first time I, I ever hit, hit you, it was with a flourish. I have no I issue hitting you with a flourish. Whisper, how did you ever graduate the guild? Look at you! You're awful! I am stomping you. I have no skill in physique, and yet I can completely dominate you in melee combat. You beat me again! I suppose this quest is yours then. But you can't stay lucky forever, farm boy. We're bound to meet again, and I'll be ready. Whisper, you're an awful person. You were planning to raid the farm to get back at me. Someone should be round to pick up the boxes soon, so we shouldn't have any more problems. Can't see why there's been so much fuss about those stones. Be glad to see the back of them myself. Must be worth plenty of money to someone, though. I'll make sure to tell everyone about you. We need heroes like you around. He just grows a different voice actor. Boast completed. Nothing was stolen. So, just from all those boasts, we've got an extra 850 gold. We've got a huge bonus for all that. That's why I really like boasts. And just blow through our, our will there, since our combat multiplier is still high. Got us an extra 210 will experience. And before we leave Orchard Farm, a little bit of loot around here. Most of it you need a shovel for. But right here. Treasure clue. Ah. You have found your first treasure clue. Rumors abound that an item of value lies hidden somewhere in Elvion. The clues should lead you to it. I understand there are six of them in all. Yep, each clue tells you how to get to the item, and uh, there are six of them, and as kind of a way to make you finish it fairly, if you don't get all the clues, the, uh, the item you will get at the end will be weaker. So if you get all six clues, that's how to make the item the strongest. I think it's kind of a cool mechanic. Before we end this episode, let's do our stats, because we haven't done that in quite a while. First of all, physique. physique. allows you to do more damage in melee combat, and to carry heavier weapons. I like to have a lot of physique. So let's actually boost that up two levels. So our physique is two. It starts at zero, so although the max is seven, it's basically eight. For skill, uh, I would like more speed. Guile increases guile. your stealth and improves your trading skill. I mostly want that for the trading skill right now, because buying and selling on zero guile sucks to try and make money with. Like I said before, I'm not going to use any exploits, although I do know a very easy exploit. Let's get more, uh, let's get a longer will bar. And we do have a lot of general experience. Let's get a little toughness. Makes you more resistant to damage. A little toughness. Health, a little health increases the amount of damage you can take. Man, I didn't think we had so much experience built Accuracy up. Accuracy allows you to cause more damage in ranged combat and make your shots more precise. Speed more. And uh, guile more. 
Do I have enough for anything else? Uh, a few little spells and stuff. Alright. So guys, a little bit buffer, a little bit taller. The health and mana bars are a lot longer. Let's see how our older guy is now that we spent a bunch of experience. We're now 27 and we just aged 7 years. We're a hunter. Unsung hunter called Chicken Chaser. You know what? Before we end the episode... Oh, we're unsung renowned status now. Before we end the episode... You know, we saved... We've, we've saved a bunch of people at the picnic area. We've saved the farmers. I think it's time we I stop being called Chicken guy. Chaser. Chick you come to the Let's right buy ourselves a good title. Arse face. No. Um. Hmm. I want to be liberator. Dark woods a dangerous place. That's an expensive one. Unsung hunter called liberator. I like it. So that's it for this episode. On the next episode, uh, I'm not entirely sure what we're going to be doing yet, but I'll find something good to do. Until next time, have a nice day.